guys! I am so happy to be making a video here. I hope y'all are happy to see me. So make sure that you subscribe, hit the notification bell. If you wanna see more of me, make sure you get notified every time I upload a video. Today, I am bringing to you this hair. It is from one of my favorite companies to shop from and that is Amazon. Actually, it's not from Amazon, but you can get the hair on Amazon through ATZ Hair. They sent this wig out to me and at first I was kinda of like, uh, but I've been wearing it and they have gotten so many compliments and it's growing on me. One thing I was a little like uh, unsure about was the length. I think this is supposed to be a 12 inch. It just seemed shorter than the picture that was online was. And so I was just like, oh, I don't really know if this is me. And then it was really dark. So I did color it a little bit. I tried to bleach the knots. I really don't think I was successful, but I think it looks really cute. I've been wearing it like this or like this. I like to show my earrings so then I kind of put it behind my ear. This is after a full day's work so it is a little bit more frizzy and fluffy but that's how my hair gets throughout the day anyway so it's okay. This is from ATZ. It says ATZ wig hair but I think it's ATZ hair. That's what is on Amazon. Y'all know I love Amazon so um, this, this wig so I got this wig on Amazon and I'm trying to pretend that I'm not struggling to get it out the box. This is what comes in the box. The hair. And then we have a weaving cap. Um, it comes ziplocked, which I really like. Oh, it smells like a factory. Okay, so this is the 4x4 lace front Brazilian wig. It's This thing is stuck to my hand. I don't, it's, I guess, static. Look at that. It's literally stuck to my hand. Does that mean I have too much static happening? I have this Kaleida Colors. This is the blue uh, Kaleida Colors. So 30 volume cream developer. Then I have the this frosting tipping cap. I used to use this like all the time. It's like a little hook thing. I had to remember how to do it. This is what the color looks like. I only bleached it one time, so it didn't get really light. So it just has the natural dark brown color mixed with the uh, reddish brown, I guess. I have it flipped upside down because I am about to bleach the knots. And this is my very first time bleaching knots. So we are going through this process together. This is the consistency. It is not runny. Um, it's kind of thick. It literally looks like toothpaste. Well, I'm just going to put it on there. I'm not pressing it into the hair. I'm just placing it on top. Every morning I'm gonna be here. Why are you crying? The knots didn't even bleach, like they're still black, so I must have missed something there. I'm so happy that I shampooed and conditioned this hair because it, it looked completely different than it does now. So now as it dries, I think I will actually like it. I'm going to use this. It's the Brunner Brothers foam and I'm just going to apply that so that as it's drying, as it's drying throughout the day tomorrow, hopefully it keeps a hold. Let me tell you something. Yes, I know we've been together for so long. You think that I can't see. Make sure that you check out ATZ 
hair on Amazon if you're interested in this hair. It does color nicely. I only did one bleaching and so it gave it this brownish look. Thumbs up this video and let me know your thoughts down below. I'm excited to talk to y'all so say something down below. All right y'all let's get the conversation started down below and I will see y'all later. Thank y'all so much for watching and I hope it helps some of you out. <laughs> Bye. Don't, don't.